Hi, welcome to the new year. Um, I have a request that I'm going to fill. This should be pretty quickly uh, done, actually. Somebody asked me to show how you hold three rings in one hand, so I'll do that. Uh, I'll even show you how to hold four. Now, I must say, this is how I do it. I have no idea if what I do is correct. It works for me. Um, I think it probably is pretty standard, although I've never actually sat down and checked with other people that are big into rings and asked how they hold them. Perhaps I should do that. Um, I'll try to explain it. What I probably have to do is hold the camera above me and look down on my hand so you can see it. Uh, in my right hand, and for that matter my left hand, it's the middle finger on most people that's the strongest finger. So when you're talking about holding rings and then throwing them to release them, a fair amount of torque and pressure is going to have to be demanded on, on one finger. Um, for me, that's going to be the middle finger because that's the one that's the strongest. And I suppose that's probably physically, anatomically true for most people. So with that in mind, when I hold um, three rings or more, although I don't juggle seven rings, so I'm only going to hold four rings for the purposes of talking about this. When I do that, it's going to be the middle finger that kind of lies through all of them. Okay, now that I've said that, let me take the camera, flip it upside down, uh, and look at my hand so you can get a sense of how I do it. All right, here we are again. I've got four rings in my hand, as you can see, hopefully. There we go. Um, and I told you that I had the middle finger that kind of runs throughout all of them. So here's how I do it when I hold three. You gotta use your other fingers to separate the rings so that when you want to, you can release them easily. So there's the first separation, okay? Then I use the ring finger like so. And if I just had three, that's what I would do. Okay, I would sort of tuck the pinky right here. So that would be how I hold three, just like this. Okay, and then when I throw, I would throw this, then this, then this. Okay, now picking them all back up, I'll show you again. Putting the, mingle, the middle finger through, separate with this one, next with the ring finger, like so, and now if I'm actually going to try to hold four, I do it like this, so that I have them separated this way. Now again, what I kind of do is I lay my thumb across all of them, and if I'm going to throw and release, I'll start with this one obviously out here first. There goes that, then that, then that, then that, and voila, there's how you hold uh, <coughs> Four. So one more time. Um, the original quest is for three. So here's how I hold three. Pick them up, put the middle finger through everything, then separate first with the index finger, secondly with my ring finger, and then the pinky. Since I've only got three in this occasion, I'll just put it right here next to the ring finger. And if, then I hold across. This keeps them all still so that if I if I accidentally move around too much, they won't slip out of my hand. And then when I want to let go, I'll move the, move the thumb, throw, and there you go. Um, all right, I hey, uh, hope that helps. Um, I know, I'm really good at taking something that's very simple and stretching it out for a long time. But I guess I'd rather say more than not enough. Hope it helps, and um, whoever requested this, I sure would like to see uh, whatever you can do with rings. Good luck, everybody.